What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with the finale of season two, episodes 11 and 12 of Kaguya sama Love is War. Now, before we get into anything, I do want to let you guys know that with the first and last episode of every season of every show that we do on the channel here, the full length version, which is normal, normally available exclusively on Patreon, is available for free for everyone. So click the link at the top of the description, get that free full length, come back here for the review. And if you enjoy that format, maybe consider checking out that Patreon. Great benefits, great community, and great time. Um, other than that, very excited to finish out this season, get into the new season, ultra, ultra romantic, something along those lines. A lot of you guys in the comments were letting me know about the legendary uh, voice actor that is Papa Miyuki, and how his. I was like, wow, oh yeah, and it even makes it makes it so much more funnier about how just like in their business he was, and it was so funny. I am very excited to find out what's going on with Ishigami, what's going to happen with this festival, where we're going to leave off for the season, and get into the season three. So without any further ado, don't forget to subscribe, click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Let's hop into this, Kaguya-sama, Love is War, Seasons 2, Episodes 11 and 12. Let's do it. So this, this is a part of their uh, routine. Their cheerleading routine, you know? <laughs> hey, at least he's getting into it. Shouts out my boy Ishigami. Good. That's it. We're just going to say that and walk away. Now, I don't think this is that girl particularly, but wasn't there a rumor about him stalking a girl or him beating up a girl's that he likes boyfriend or something like that, like injuring him? That's oh, I feel so bad. He was just having way more of a positive outlook on life. And then really, and he still wants him to do it. Oh, good word. Not the other word that we know about. I don't want that to be distorted or viewed in a different aspect or anything. It'd be so easy with someone with social anxiety to dig into this, like, bubble that just... It's so easy to assume other people are talking about you. I know exactly what he's going through right now. And I feel so I feel so bad because Ishigami is one of like low key like the nicer, caring people in the show, you know. And he's so funny. So it is her. I really like her eye color. I won't lie. Kyoko Otomo. That's all it takes. You don't even really need to be exceptionally nice to someone, you know. Just be a decent person. On the phone making plans with a support, right? It looks like he's making a hotel reservation with another girl to cheat. See, that never made sense to me. Why would you have a girlfriend if you're so obsessed with other girls? Like, just break up with Kyoko. It makes no sense. So, I mean, in a fury of rage, obviously, he's still 100% in the wrong. He should have never resorted to violence, but when you just get past a certain point, especially, you know. And, of course, people only seeing this not knowing the truth of what really happened, you know. Eh. Word spreads, I get it. One, he's manipulating the situation to make him look like more of the victim. Two, he's playing his ultimate trump card. I don't know if it has anything in particular to do with his social anxiety, but I am liking a lot how they've been animating a lot of the people without eyes like that. 
because like in a silent voice you know they did that with the x's it just has to do with how the person feels you know i could totally understand it being like that and he is not making a good case for himself and he's super like emotionally and like upset and i get that damn i feel so bad damn man he's been dealing with a lot of shit since then so that's crazy right He was so in the right when it comes to that situation, so I get it, you know? See, it's people like him who, yeah, get played, he plays the victim card, he gets seen as the bigger man, he gets seen, like, it's so, right? Like... Damn, man. I never truly realized what my man was going through or how deep this went, you know? He still hasn't written. He still hasn't written it. I need some crazy happy moment or something right now. I need something to turn my turn me around. This is depressing. He is lost in like a brain fog. He's the definite... As that fog clears up. That boy Miyuki. Don't worry about anything else. Focus on you, yourself, and this run. You were the fastest on the track team. Did we get visited by Miyuki? The goat himself? After going through everything Ishigami went through, if there was one person I could have in my corner, it would probably be Miyuki. And of course, Detective. <laughs> Detective Miyuki's on the squad. That we came to, the student council report. I see. Technically, yeah. <laughs> in the roundabout way things went, you know? Yeah. That's what I'm saying. The fact is, he could have handled it smarter. He did, but he, he was coming from good intentions for him, or, you know, it was justice. It was the right thing, you know? <laughs> I love how Ishigami's fully in the shadows and Miyuki brings a light with him, you know? Is a letter of a. Uh... Introduction to the student council. Come on, Mr. Treasurer. <laughs> Go to hell, dumbass. And since then, Miyuki and Ishigami have been the fucking boys. Goddamn. Shit's bringing me to tears. I know. I feel so bad for my boy. Shouts out my boy Ishigami. Goddamn. I, oh, if he wins this with the anchor, man. Oh, you feel like that? Till the end of your days but go to hell dumbass that's all i gotta say hell yeah i'm shaking you off no more looking back hell no my man we got the whole squad come on Migo, ito and everyone come on man god damn it Oh, he's still barely lost. No. <laughs> I love how no one's blaming him. They're all, they're all saying he did good, you know? I feel so good for my man Ishigami. And they finally animate all their eyes and shit, you know? <laughs> Never would have thought, man. Kaguya Summer Love is a war bringing me to goddamn tears. And now seeing all their eyes, man. At first, I just thought it was because they're side characters, you know, stuff like that. But I love the aesthetic choice. <laughs> oh. 
We know Kaguya is the one with the excessive plans, you know? I'm looking out for Ishigami too, I love that. That is true. That's the boy, Ishigami, come on, man. Still got the other challenges and we, come on. For how shitty of a life he should got me led up until now. I'm so happy when he still has that and happy had a great time. God damn it. Woo. That was quite the fucking episode. God damn. All right. Had to take a quick moment to recollect myself, but on to episode 12, the final episode of season two. Let's do it. I mean, there's always excessively taking pictures, you know, but a picture is worth a thousand words. It's a memory that'll last a lifetime. Now we got Miko Ino, Miyuki, Chika, Ishigami, the whole squad. Talk about memories, you know. Aww. And now we're having an official group photo. Yeah, just be happy. Alright, Vogue. That's, that's somewhat bubbly. The things photographers do to get that, <laughs> to get you comfortable to show them your face. Gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> I know. Yeah, if someone tells you to look like that, biting pens, like, okay. That's it. So innocent. The passion of youth. Jesus. Now you said everything you needed to say. Now Kagu is on your team. You thought of you as a <laughs> as a whack. <laughs> yeah, we're making. Yes, we gotta have her in the photo. Come on. Yeah, it doesn't need to be in the pamphlet. No social media. This could be just for you. Documenting your daily life as an ordinary girl. Yeah, Mi Miyuki was able to tell. They were all able to tell, but come on. Are you serious? What unfortunate luck. Man, I was so happy. They were going to have a group pick at the end of season two. Something she can always look back on. It's kaput. <sighs> were you signed into the cloud? Good way to look at it. But you know she's still sad. Yeah, we had a lot of memories on there. God damn, even cat ears Miyuki. There's gotta be something we could do to save and retrieve these photos. Wow. That is that. You hate to see it. Oh, kawaii. Yeah, normally Kaguya would be playing along. Ayasaka's just feeding into it, but Kaguya is in a bad mood, sadly. If you ask for her, her number, it's a confession of love. Oh, no games being played. He really is not in the mood for this love is war shenanigans. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, 
Three just completely, I know, different reasons. Ooh, group chats. Group chats are always the best. Ooh, for photos? To the cloud. <laughs> now the, the light in her eyes physically come back. I love that. At least now you have some memories from the squad, you know? Oh, look at all those photos. Those are so fun. So many memories. It's like a little mini recap, you know? <laughs> look at all those funny parts. Yeah. Aww. Aww. Shouts out to the squad. One of the one of the very few benefits of modern technology. We can share memories like this that last a lifetime. That's nice. Everyone wins. Aw. That's nice. That's a real heart warmer. But you have to pump it at least once? Oh, it's like the drink game. I've seen this, but for drinking. Yep. So you pour a little bit over and it's like near the edge. And if you were the one that makes it go, yeah, okay, I've seen this. Chico always has the fun ass game. I know. Here's over here. You have to pump and you have to put <laughs> You guys are pervs. Now, a good strategy when you're playing with this many people is to bring it right on the verge of explosion. So you're damn near confirmed it's not going to go loop back to you, you know? <laughs> the good old cheat calming. It's a counter. It's a counter. What do you do? <laughs> Not the balloon bimbo. Whoa there, Mr. Watch This. I know, he said. And now he's not that kind of man anymore. I mean, look at the size of that thing. It looks like Indiana Jones, like, boulder. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Don't just say it like that, narrator. <laughs> Is that true? Oh. Chica is manipulating this girl. <laughs> they're all they're all egging her on. <laughs> they're all fucked up. So are you gonna be a man and take it for her? Oh, some advice from Papa Papa Shirogane, Papa Gane. The son recalled his father's words. <laughs> There's no way. That's so funny. That's so. <laughs> Them playing the openings during this, I love that. She has a. These are the credits. I love this. Oh my god. I love that. 
We got K, Chica's sister. This what is this like a shonen? Sailor, what is this? The school is gone now. Oh god, that was hilarious. Oh. The battle rage is on into season three. <laughs> oh god damn it. Imagine having to wait for oh that's a great photo too. Imagine having to wait for season three. I can just watch it tomorrow, god damn it. Oh my goodness. Talk about some episodes. <laughs> Those might have been some of my favorites in this show. Uh starting with the Ishigami one, that one hit me so hard in my heart. And then for them to play jokes on it later and just be like, that whole thing meant nothing. And then like Miyuki's dad, the advice, he remembered those, but then completely ignored it. It's like they, they have such a self-aware satire parody on like anime in general. It's so funny. And they work so well together. And I love how we had a great art little moment with uh, Ishigami and his social anxiety and what he did growing up versus Kaguya and her change in perspective over the years of growing with friends and stuff like that. I gotta say, man, that Ishigami story, that was really good. Like, the how much Miyuki, the student council, influenced him, and then to the cheerleading squad, and how just having, honestly, like it's gonna relate to Miyuki the most, but having that one friend, that having that one guy, you know, he obviously extended it to the rest of the student council, but having that one guy reach out and show you the light when you're stuck in those shadows, man, so metaphorical so big and I, I, I thoroughly Miyuki's the best I mean everyone says Ishigami's best boy they're all bet like they're just they're such good like I love them all you know everyone was like uh rooting for him during that race and everything god damn it it hits me in my feels I love it so so much and then Kaguya with the group picture and then the whole balloon. I love how the balloon exploded into the opening, which was the credits, which was everyone saying goodbye, a little recap. Oh, so good. So well done. Shouts out to Kaguya-sama. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Check out that Patreon for early access, full length, up to one week, all that jazz, full uncut. Don't forget to drink some water. Tell someone you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace out. Thank <laughs> you.